Oh, everyone's here. Ah, our king arrived, is he? You made me king. After all this is over with, they're actually going to put me on the throne. I'm still... I'm going to be the king. Yes? Is that a thank you? Thank you? You want me to thank you? How could you do this to me? I've done nothing but regret my blood since the day I was born. I don't want this. I never wanted this. I hate the very idea of it. <laughs> I knew that Arlima wanted this for me, but I never did. I thought for sure that there would be a way out of it. But then you went and put me on a throne yourself. Why? 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 Because I enjoy torturing you, that's why. Oh, wonderful. And here I thought I only had the Darkspawn to worry about. I've just never thought of myself as a leader. I'm going to make a terrible king, you have to know that. How can I make decisions that are going to affect the lives of everyone in the kingdom? I guess I don't really have a choice in this now, do I? I'll do my best, of course, and I expect that you'll be there to help me, right? <laughs> no. You think I'm stupid? <laughs> of course I'll be there, you damn fool. Good. Then it's settled. Arleman has left for Redcliffe. He says the army has gathered there and is almost ready to march. As soon as we're ready, we should head to Redcliffe ourselves. The blight awaits, right? Yes, he's all knickers in a knot now, but don't worry. He will come to his senses soon enough. Unless the disapproves again. I love his disapproval. I love making him angry. He has never been my friend, to be perfectly frank with you. He's, he's one of the lowest relationships I've got. Liliana, Morrigan, everybody else is perfectly fine. But Alistair, there's never, we could never get to that level, that next step with him, could we? Right, really? Morrigan, you are the last one I shall speak with. If one more servant asks if I would like a change of clothes, I will set the house on fire. <laughs> I await your command. Set the house on fire. We are hardly alone, so privacy is not an option. It is your question, however. Ask what you will. So, what do I have to do to get on your good side? You are already on my good side, such as it is. Or do you seek something else? Something more... intimate? Uh, uh, uh... I think so, yes. Oh, good to know that. Let me see. I would expect favor to come with a price. Really? Perhaps you would be willing to pay a compliment. Is that too much? Uh, compliment? Mm -hmm. uh, you have uh, uh, nice arms. Is that compliment enough for you? <laughs> I'm just joking. You're brilliant and amazing. Is that good enough? I suppose stating the obvious will have to do. Very well then. You are on my good side. Best watch your step that you don't fall off. <laughs> okay, I will do indeed. I will watch my step every step of the way. I bless her. Right, now that we have done with that, I think we better rush on off to Redcliffe. What present? Here it is. One last look around. We have spent many an hour here, passing the time away. Even getting ambushed by Darkspawn on one occasion. This will be the last time we see this place. And one last time I assume we will see Sandal. And one last time we will hear this beloved sound. Enchantment? Enchantment? Yes, please. Enchantment! Enchantment! Thank you for abusing me. All those times, Sandal. Right. Goodbye, party camp. It won't be missed. But to be perfectly frank with you, it was quite uncomfortable in those tents. Right. Liliana. Indeed. Morrigan. Indeed. And Alistair. Yes. To Redcliffe. Yes, as I was said last time we came here, before we ambled off to party camp just for some nostalgic purposes, it looks like there's been a battle here. It's... it's you! The Grey Warden! Yes? Andraste's mercy that you got here when you did. I thought for sure these monsters were going to get me. Monsters? What's happened? Where is everybody? They all fled to the castle this morning. 
before the Darkspawn arrived. I thought I could make it to my home and back before they got here, but it took me too long to get down here. What a relief you arrived. Right. Well, you should get to safety. I'm going to get out of here before any more of those things arrive. Thank you again. Good God. Things are looking dire. Quickly, to the castle. More foul dogs. Oh, you've got to be joking me. Really? Dark spawn here in Redcliffe? Oh my god. We're not getting to the castle. Why are we going down, down further into blighted lands here? Oh. Alright, come on. It's done. Let's get to the castle. Oh god, may I like what? <laughs> Answer for message? Not left. Can't be that important then. Twisted creatures! Oh my god. Wait a second. The final onslaught. I assume we need to get inside the castle here. Come on! Aren't you firing that? Come here! Leave Monica alone! Oh, look at this! Come on! Come down and help my friends! They're getting ambushed here! Uh, can we hit with bloody face? Get out of it! Come on! Inside! What? Oh? Holy guacamole! I have to stop running from him! Uh oh, he's going after somebody here! Oh. Things are looking grim here! Oh, no. You're here! Thank goodness! Oh, Deary me! Did that spawn get inside the castle? Some did, yes, but we were able to close the gates and kill the ones in the courtyard. I was told to watch for your arrival, Warden. Your comrade Riordan arrived just ahead of the Darkspawn attack. He has urgent news for you. Fine! Fine! Take me inside! There must be no more delays! I should take you to the hall right away, my lord. They'll be waiting for you there. It's a relief to see you unharmed, and you as well, Alistair. Or should I say your majesty? Uh, no, no, I wouldn't say that. Not yet, anyway. The darkspawn that attacked Threadcliffe were relatively few in number, I'm afraid. It was assumed the Horde was marching in this direction, but that is not true. Riordan tells us that the bulk of the Horde is in fact heading towards Denerim. They are perhaps two days away from the capital. What? What? Are we sure about that? I mean, if that's true... I ventured close enough to listen in, as it were. I am quite certain. Oh, God. Why on earth did we think they were headed here? The Darkspawn line is wide, and many of them roam away from the main horde. Until now, most of them have been spotted here in the West. Not to mention that we've been too busy killing each other to pay much attention to some silly old Darkspawn horde. There is, I'm afraid, one other piece of news that is of even greater concern. Oh, what now? The Archdemon has shown itself. The dragon is at the head of the Horde. Make her preserve us. Huh. 
But we can't reach Denderim within two days, can we? It's too far. We must begin a forced march to the capital immediately with what we have. Denerim must be defended at all costs. Oh my god. Is it even possible to reach the city in time? Perhaps not. But what is important is that we know where the Archdemon will be. If we do not defeat the Archdemon, it will not matter if Denerim is saved or the Horde defeated. And only the Grey Wardens can defeat the Archdemon. That is why we must go. Then we march and hope the army we've collected here gives us the chance we need. Al Eamon, how long before the army can set out? By daybreak. Then let's get them ready. I won't let all those people die without giving them a chance. Okay. Then we're off to war then. Let's do it. I will give the orders at once, and will notify you the moment we are ready to march. That would be appreciated. Then if you and Alistair could meet me before you retire, we have Grey Warden business to discuss. I will have someone show you to your rooms. I suggest you all get some rest while you can. We will need it. Oh, okay. Grey Warden business, eh? You have gathered your armies, and it is time to lead them against the greatest threat that the Ferelden has seen in centuries. The Archdemon and the Darkspawn have reached Denerim and it will fall to the Blight unless you do something about it. You must speak to the Grey Warden Reardon before you retire for the night. Tomorrow, you will march to Denerim. Hello, my Dwarven friends. I am glad to see you here. Glad to see you indeed. Ah, Poochie. Hello, everybody. Your presence is... For, oh, I thought it was the last I seen of you. You're st here. <laughs> Welcome. I don't want to speak to you again just to embarrass you further. But rest assured your presence is very much appreciated. Okay, I think we need to go to the second floor. Ding. 